A lot of people say Christian faith is about deeds, not creeds. It's about what we do, not about a bunch of doctrines. Uh, but the, the, there, there are problems there, of course, because uh, the gospel is a doctrine. The gospel is an announcement about something that God has done to save us. It's not good advice. It's not uh, good principles for living. The gospel is good news. So if you don't know the doctrine, you don't know that he was crucified for our sins and raised for our justification, then uh, Christianity amounts to nothing more than a self-help program or bland moralism. But the, the, the kind of deeds that grow out of the Christian faith uh, are rooted in the gospel. Uh, when people sometimes say, uh, you know, I, I have a personal relationship with Jesus. I don't, I don't want to know about Jesus. I want to know Jesus. I think that wouldn't work with my wife. Uh, you know, I come back to her one of these days and say, honey, I, uh, I know that I, I don't know anything about you. Uh, I don't know your favorite color. I don't know what you're like. I don't know your characteristics. Uh, I don't know where you grew up. I don't know anything about you because that would get in the way of knowing you. We don't talk about anybody like that until we come to God. You know, the more I know about my wife, the more I fall in love with her. The more we know about God, who he is, what he's done for us, the, the more we entrust our lives to him. Our faith grows, and out of our faith, love, and out of our love, works. And so genuine Christian piety, truly good works that come from faith, come from doctrine come from that proclamation of Christ, who he is, what he's done. So I like to think of it in terms of the four Ds. You have the drama that tells us what God has done, and then the doctrine that tells us how that relates to us, and then the doxology, the, the emotion, the, the thanksgiving, the experience that comes out of that, which fuels then the discipleship, our lives in the world. If we get that out of whack or we remove one of those, we have an incomplete Christianity.